Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Today we have Death of the Undying. Last episode was a pretty big one. I mean, it feels like all these storylines are kind of starting to clash. Scar is getting involved with the, the death of Winry's parents. Hawkeye's in trouble on this tower with Gluttony, while at the same time down below, they're dealing with uh, the Butcher's real body. I, I think a lot of people are starting to realize how corrupt everything is, how corrupt the government is. Last episode, we found out, of course, that uh, Maria Ross is actually still alive. It was all known to Mustang how she was framed and he wanted to just get her out of the situation without having to kill her because i'm pretty sure he recognized that if he hadn't it would have resulted in her death anyways or at least the trial being concluded with her dying so i mean it was either her dying being convicted of being guilty or just faking her death and her being able to live we even saw her crying as she was rode away to, in, through the desert to this other land because i mean she has to leave her whole life behind even her parents can't know that she's still alive so we're gonna hop right into it uh, let's uh get going so this piece of info is supposed to be confidential but whatever. Nothing's confidential Barry around him. The colonel's got a plan to smoke out some military guys he's been after. The fifth laboratory. Al knows exactly what. I gotta find them. Hey, not so fast. Tell me your secret first. I'll tell you when I get back, okay? Come on, that's so unfair. I'll be back soon. Ling just wants to be in a loop on everything, dude. That is so bizarre. Be careful, I promise. I don't like this this title card either. Death of the Undying. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mustang Saber! Mustang has to be like right there. Oh! Oh! No! The doggy! Stop it! You better not eat that dog, Gluttony! You know guns don't work! Oh, wait, hit him off of the. God, he is a unit, dude. I don't think he would even fit through that little crevice. Bullet's gone. Goody, goody. I get to have dinner and dessert. Oh! Mustang! Let's go, baby! Yes, sir! Oh my gosh. Well, they could have just run down the stairs. Colonel, technically. What the hell did you leave your post? No matter what happened to us, you could still have kept your involvement a secret. That was the whole idea, right? Don't sing in here, plain as day. Are you a complete idiot? Yeah, fine, fine. <laughs> For caring about his friends. Yo, go finish the job. What the heck was that for? Please! Colonel! The target's on the he move. clearly has regenerative powers. Sergeant, don't leave a single trace. And you stay right by the sergeant's side, Hayate. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> the little puppy. At least Colonel, the puppy's okay. What a brave dog. Thanks for saving us back there. Oh, now Colonel, you thank him. Let's just stay focused on the mission for now. Aww. That's that little smirk like. He cares about Wait, us. Get in. Ow. Are you trying to go after Mr. Hughes's murderer? Let him in. You win. <laughs> yeah. Dude, Ed's just not even there. It's so weird. Don't let him get away. He ain't going nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> My soul won't be able to rest. Not until I eviscerate that meatbag. I love how Barry's like on their side. From that blubber beast back there. I doubt it. I scorched him off the ledge. Dude, but yeah, and I shot him. In the yeah, head. she shot him several really times in the face. Corley is like. He didn't have an Ouroboros tattoo, did he? On his tongue. Actually, yeah, on his tongue. Watch it, Mustang. So you probably He's should turn around. That's just not possible. Yeah, that's what I thought until I got kidnapped by a homunculus. Called himself Greed. One thing he told me is that nothing is impossible. I watched Greed get the top half of his head knocked off. I wonder if this other Barry is gonna lead them later. right to where real, all right. the they sins are. Like he wants to return home I naturally. Like Hold home. on. I rendered Fat Boy down to a bubbling puddle back there. No. Telling me he's you didn't. Alive? You didn't see. He just landed. Never-ending parade of freaks lately, huh? God, those red eyes. Not ominous at all. <laughs> Barry. My body ran in there to think it can hide from. Yeah, let him ride to it if so. So this ties them directly to the military. There you go. That's all we need for now. Well, you have fun with that. Get back here. Yeah. That psycho stormed the building. He ran in? Oh, because he does the dirty work. <laughs> Mustang doesn't have to be very clearly involved. And clearly, Barry's going to be able to get past the, the first kind of outer walls. Nell must evacuate immediately. Oh, and then they play it off as the oh, as them chasing Barry. Very nice. Let's go. Very clean Mustang. How the hell are we supposed to find it? We're gonna have to split up. But now Gluttony's just chilling out there. Why do you have to split up? It doesn't look like anybody's used this lab in a while. But whatever they did here was painful. Bone saw. 
Well now, I am just shocked. <laughs> it's bad enough that you stood me up on our date. Now you point a gun at me? Solaris? What's going on? Hey, Havoc. Girl's got the tattoo. First I've seen it, sir. <laughs> <laughs> the sound effects. Why are they moving? Uh, I can see how she tricked you so easily. I've always been a sucker for big boobs. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! I can't help it! I love him! <laughs> Did you tell this woman anything? Oh no, my god. I never god. said a single thing about work, sir. Do you know who Maze Hughes is? Yes, he was quite the intelligent man, wouldn't you agree? I only wish I'd had the opportunity to pick his brain. <laughs> On your knees. Don't think that matters to her. Sorry to say. Yeah. But it's gonna take more than you're capable of to make me get on my knees. How merciless. Did you pick that up in Ishval? You're a homunculus. Well, she has the tattoo. Oh! It's a philosopher's stone. Oh! I was created with this stone at my core. It's not just a legend. Wait, so do all of them have that? You're a monster. Even that was uncalled for. Gluttony? I do have feelings. Got a funny feeling the only reason you're telling us this is because you don't plan on letting us live. Too slow. Oh no. No, did I get your ignition glove all wet? Just run! Thank you! Why are you laying there? No, she made a big mistake. Oh. She flooded the room with water. A simple transmutation and we've got hydrogen gas. Ah, yes. Exactly what I was thinking. Oh! Go! Where are you going? There's an explosion. You go to the explosion. This is a gift from one of my ex-girlfriends. Man. There's no way you're actually Turn. sad about that. And giving me a light here. All right, you're all wet. Yeah, well, those things will kill you. You know that? She's dust. I definitely cremated her. No, you don't. The stench. See the I'm body. Familiar with that stink by now. You mean from that time you spent in Ishval? You have For to assume know, that they're still, still alive. Jet. I've learned literally yeah. from Mustang. Yes, sir. He faked burning a body. <laughs> oh, my gosh, it's painful, dude. Havoc! That's horrifying. Well, you got a lot of her body. He's a dead man. No, he's not. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's nothing you can do that'll kill me. It was more just to distract her. If I borrow this. Oh! He actually got it! Yo! Wait, Mustang's so alpha! He just ran up and grabbed it! What is happening, dude? I don't know that much about You don't know what's gonna happen. Don't do it right now. You should amplify my abilities. What if it just Oh, it like turns you into another you her. Buy a girl dinner first before you stick your hand in her chest. Okay, so once a a Oh my god, Mustang's dead. Once a philosopher's stone is like set for it's Bradley. Your Excellency! Oh no. What's the current status? Oh, the no. criminal responsible for the prison break has stormed the premises, but Colonel Mustang and his men are in pursuit. Well then, I'll give him some backup. He knows. Very good. We're right behind you, sir. I'd prefer to handle it on my own. I told Dude. you. Dude. Yeah, once a philosopher's stone, stone is a person, it's like, it can't be used for anyone else. I really hate to do this. You were a poor candidate for sacrifice and all. Save your breath. I want you to watch poor Jean bleed to death. Jean? Where's... Hey, answer me. Where's Hawkeye? Havoc. Ow. Can't die. Not yet. Not before I do. Sorry, but you got here too late. My body is damn near entirely decayed. I guess a body just can't hold up with someone else's soul being shoved inside of it. <gasps> If a soul is incompatible with another person's body, be the same for a soul bonded to a suit of armor? <laughs> oh, no, I was wondering there. when you were gonna show up, Lusty. Care to explain why you're helping the Colonel? I thought it'd be fun to switch things up. I've wanted to chop you up since I met you. You're such a handful. Please, someone to help, Mustang. And I'm sad to see you here, armor boy. It's bad enough to lose one, 
But now you're forcing me to kill a second candidate. You and Mr. Gallantry. That's enough of the casual chit chat. All I want to hear from you is screaming. Ah! No, Barry! <gasps> no! I do hate overconfident men. I think I was about to send the lieutenant to join her superior. So when you said you'd already had to kill someone... <laughs> you bitch! I'm not accepting Mustang's death until I see his body. Until I see him like dead, dead. Such a sad and weak. There's no way, dude. It's Mustang. Stand up, Lieutenant. You need to get out of here. You want me to kill you first? Oh shoot. It appears you've opened the portal. <laughs> Such a shame. You Don't you hurt to... now! He's throwing himself in the way. Leave me and save yourself. Go! I won't leave you! If she even I'm touches that mark. People die, and I can't just sit back and take it anymore. I won't let anyone else get killed. Not when I can protect them. Well spoken. Ah! Three more. What I say? Through the wall. What did I say? Burn her more. Knees, after all. He's using the flint for ignition, and he carved a transmutation circle into his hand. Oh God! You should have fled to death by now. I seared the wound closed and came close to passing out from the pain. Oh my gosh! Mustang's so insane. Kill her! Burn! But I'd like to try and prove you wrong. How many times is it gonna take? Wait, but where's Bradley? No! Keep going, Colonel! Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. She almost got him. How is she still alive? You killed me. <gasps> I hate losing. But there are worse ways to die than at the hands of a man like you. Cold and focused your eyes are. I look forward to the day when those eyes will be wide with agony. It's coming. It's coming. Dude! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I thought Bradley was gonna walk up in the middle of that. I had so much anxiety. Me. We need to get you some help. Thanks, Alphonse. Thank you for looking after my subordinate. Yeah, sure. Dude, Ed's gonna get doctor. back to hell. A doctor for Havoc. There he is. He's just watching. Cause why reveal himself? If any of them escape, it's it's over for him. Oh my it's all right. God. The scars. Uh, hey, I'm home now. Oh. <laughs> Moron! Welcome back! Okay, thanks. She was just worried uh, about uh, you, Al. Well, uh, <laughs> 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 That shouldn't happen! <laughs> the hair, like, stood <laughs> straight up. Oh my god. Is that like... Holy. That was way too damn close. Barry's alive! Maybe someone can fix me. Rather not live my life as sheet metal. Oh, what the? How the hell are you still alive? Hey. Oh, no. Put yourself Put back together! Right I've got a second chance to terrorize the city. You're gonna ruin everything. No, don't do it. Wait. No, stop, please. Barry is freed. Oh my god. Dude. <laughs> So much happened in this episode. I, I'm overwhelmed. Dad? Oh shoot! No. It can't be. Is it? How I know.
<laughs> what, dude? Oh my god. Oh, there's way too much that just happened in that short episode. Jeez. So, wait, Lust is dead. One of the sins is dead. That fight was insane. Man's carved a circle into his hand with his own blood. Oh my gosh. There was way too much to unpack there. Holy crap. So, next episode, we may see. That's like the reunion. Oh my gosh. There's no way. I'm just proud of Al. Honestly, kid stood his ground so hard. There was no way he could have beat Lust alone, and he knew that. But he still stood for Hawkeye. Oh my gosh. Rip Havoc, but Mustang is a beast. What an absolute beast. Guys, that is it for this episode. Way too much to unpack there. That was a lot in a very short span of time. I'm so excited to see what happens with this potential reunion next episode. Probably, like, reasons for why Al and Ed's dad have been gone. Like I said from the very beginning, I thought he fit a bigger piece of the puzzle from the very beginning like there's like there's probably a much bigger reason that he left very early on probably has a lot more to do with their story than they're aware of but still oh my gosh ed has so much to learn when they get back especially with how each homunculus has a philosopher's stone inside of them i'm i'm freaking my brain is going 100 miles an hour guys i hope you enjoyed this episode i love you all and i will uh, see you next time peace, peace.